DuckDB has been all around for storing, reading data, and data pipelines. But what's possible in the dashboarding world? Indeed, once you have your data somewhere, you easily have a BI tool that would query this data. The challenge here is that you have a local DuckDB with your data, and it's not so easy to share and make it available for your data visualization tool. And that's where Mother Duck comes into play, right? Yeah, that's what I was about to say. If you have data in Mother Duck, which is a serverless analytics platform based on DuckDB, you can use a couple of data visualization tools. We won't cover how to load data to Mother Duck, but it's pretty straightforward coming from DuckDB or some Parquet CSV file, and I'd put a link in the description in case you need to do so. All right, coming back to database, we'll cover two options here, X and superset preset. Yeah, I know, it's three options, I still can count. This video is not a benchmark of which database tool is the best, but I will tell you one great feature I like about each one of them. So let's hit some database. I promise there won't be any pie chart. X is a software for collaborative data science and analytics using Python, SQL, and NoCo. You can see it as a super notebook. It provides different kinds of cells, including database cells, and you can easily publish and share it through your teammates or external people. And that's my favorite feature because you can go from exploration to publishing really fast. It doesn't matter how great your insight is if you cannot share it, right? So guess what? DuckDB in X is already pre-installed and anywhere you have DuckDB, you can run Mother Duck. It's worth to note that Mother Duck at this point of time only support one version of DuckDB, the latest. You can always check which version we are supporting in our docs. You can quickly run a cell in X in Python to double check this version. Yes, we are good to go. The first step is to safely store your murder duck token. X has a feature for this. You can do this by creating a new secret in X. To get your murder duck service token, just head up over your profile and you will see right there. The secret will be available as a Python variable and we can export it then as an environment variable for our session would it be a SQL or a Python cell? And that's pretty much it. Now you can connect as you would do through a Python, for instance. We just need to mention md colon, and that's because our service token is already available as an environment variable. So let's run a query against the sample data database. This is a shared database, which is available for all modern Duck users and contains a bunch of data set that you can play with. Let's run a query against the New York City taxi dataset to understand what are the peak hours. Now we have this query returned as a data frame and we can add a shard cell, select our data frame and the right parameters to have this beautiful bar chart to understand how the peak hours is evolving over the week. Okay, dashboarding might not be the place where I excel and neither excel. All right, let's move to the next database tool, preset and superset. So Apache Superset is an open source data exploration and visualization platform designed to be intuitive and interactive. The mastermind behind this project is Maxime Beauchemin, who also created Airflow. While my open source project seems to fizzle out, it keeps doing home run. So Superset can quickly integrate and analyze data from various sources, including DuckDB and Modern Duck. For the sake of this demo, we're gonna use preset, but rest assured, it's almost the same thing if you need to connect Mother Duck with Superset. And I'll put the link in the description for both guides in case you need. So preset is great for people with less coding skills. The dashboarding experience is easy through the UI. And I really like how they started with the SQL lab, then you create a shard, then you create a dashboard, and you have reusable component towards those. So let's connect to preset. Head over to settings and click on database connection. Select mother duck. And we are going to need to fill the SQL Alchemy URI that follow this pattern. Note that the database name is optional. So you can have one connection to mother duck and query multiple databases. Finally, you can test that your token connection is valid by clicking test connection and click connect. All right, let's make the same bar chart we just had earlier in X. First, we can go to the SQL lab, run the query and save it as a data set. Next, we create the same bar chart we did earlier. 
And once it's done, we can add this one to a dashboard. And then I can put it anywhere, resize it. It's beautiful. Wow. Yes, you should be proud of your art, even if it's modest. Look at what my kid did. It's beautiful. Wow. Yes, no, I'm not biased. All right, here you have two options to do amazing data visualizations using X or SuperSert slash preset. And don't worry, more are coming. Don't forget to check the description for written tutorials and content about these tools. And do let me know if there is a specific database tool that you would like me to cover. Anyway, quite you soon and keep on coding.